subscribe to Gizmo Times and get notified about our latest videos by hitting the bell icon. Hey guys, welcome to Gizmo Times. This is Chetan and this is the Lava Z50, the first Android Go phone in India. Even the Nokia one is official now and the Bharat Go as well is. But then this was the first one that's shipping already. Uh, we bought this device in Snapdeal uh, where this uh, phone is exclusively available and it's powered by MediaTek, the MediaTek MT6737, 1.1 GHz port purpose. It says made in India, that's uh, the assembling uh, being done in India and this comes with 2 years warranty. And on the side what you see is a free screen replacement that's now obsolete because uh, it's valid for purchases only until 31st March. And uh, this comes with the ATL 2000 cashback but with a lot of clauses obviously you will have to do a multiple number of recharges to finally get that cashback and for the performance you see here the open applications are 50 percent faster and the 15 percent additional free ram that is because of the go apps that are given in this phone you can save youtube videos and share without data and that is what the youtube go app was all about you can if you have the go youtube go on two devices you can share the videos from one to the other without even needing any data because that is a hotspot based uh, sharing that is done there and for the camera combination on the front and back there's 5 megapixel uh, cameras on both the sides uh, with the fla flashback support there there's also a 2.5d curved conning gorilla glass it should be probably the gorilla glass 3 but there's nothing uh, mentioned about the same so this is the box package the phone is priced at rupees 4399 and let's unbox this so this is the phone uh, with the 4.5 inch display on the front uh, that's the FWVGA 854 into 480 pixels of uh, screen resolution here it's quite light right now I guess because there's no battery otherwise the phone with the battery is about 140 grams in weight and this is the plastic back on uh, the phone there's no battery embedded but before that let's check out this uh, slots here it's a micro SD card slot for the first one and these are two sim card slots so this is a dual sim uh, mobile along with the dedicated uh, micro SD card which is a uh, pretty much common feature for the basic uh, or the budget smartphones let's keep this aside so firstly in the set of accessories you get this uh, rubber case along with that is this 2000 mAh battery which powers the phone uh, we'll place this later and uh, start the phone and apart from that what you see here is this uh, screen guard uh, which is not a tempered glass it's a basic uh, screen guard that you see for the scratch resistance and this is the warranty certificate this is the set of earphones from uh, lava that also comes with the microphone and this is the micro usb uh, cable and that is for uh, both uh, transferring data from it to the computer and also for charging the device and finally this is uh, the power adapter that comes with the 5v1a uh, the um, basic uh, charging speeds and you can't expect more than that for uh, these kind of smartphones so now let's insert the battery and check out uh, how the interface is because uh, that is uh, the most interesting part of this phone the android go OS based on Android Oreo. So while the phone starts, let's talk about uh, the exterior of the device. Uh, on the top, you get the micro USB uh, port, which uh, which is kind of uh, weird because uh, the usual placement of it should be in the bottom of the device. Beside that is the 3.5 headset jack. On the back is this 5 megapixel uh, camera along with the LED flashlight. On the right are the buttons, the power button and the volume rocker buttons. On the front again, there's a 5 megapixel camera along with the earpiece grill, the LED flash, and a set of sensors. That there, there are just two sensors and what you see here is the light sensor and within the device there is an accelerometer towards the bottom is the microphone and there is no secondary microphone for any noise cancellation and uh, on the front these are uh, the three capacitive touch buttons uh, for the navigation and they are not backlit they are the basic buttons with the recent key, the home key and the back key here so here is the home screen uh, you will have, have to pull this up to go to the app list or the app drawer and this is the basic android the stock android but this is again not the real stock android it's the android go version here and these are the various applications that you see the first one is the 100 percent free games which are a few basic games again and they come with the demo version you have to install the full versions of them this google go assistant and this uh, the basic browser the entire set of again google apps the chrome browser there's no go version for the chrome one because it's the regular browser there this file go google go and uh, maps go as well along with that finally what you see is the youtube go youtube go is an interesting application here because uh, that would help not just download and uh, share the videos but a lot more than that and for the pre-installed apps you also see the facebook Lite application given here and that is it uh, let's get into the settings and check out the android version of uh, this device it's 8.1.0 the android oreo based uh, android go os and for the storage and ram what you see is 5.60 uh, GB of storage that's available out of 8 GB and this 1 GB of RAM uh, that is given to the users 
so this is the basic uh, interface that you see here and this is the camera application that will quickly check here it's a 5 MP plus 5 MP combination here on the back and front and again the camera is uh, similar to how you get on the basic uh, Android devices also if you compare this with the Oppo and Vivo phones it's almost the same cam uh, camera application with these uh, swiping gestures to move to the different modes there's also a beauty mode for the rear camera and also the funny cam that would give you some of those uh, stickers that's quite interesting for a phone of this price range because you get the stickers when the face is recognized and you can then place those stickers to make the pictures a bit funnier and this is the front facing camera the 5 megapixel one and look at this uh, you'll see some of those uh, stickers already being placed and this is the funny cam and there's also this beauty mode that recognizes the face and that would blur out everything else again for a basic phone for a budget phone that is something uh, quite good and you get to set the beauty levels here and this is the 5 megapixel uh, regular selfie uh, mode and for the functionality you see be video beauty as well time lapse filters can be placed a template and panorama these are the different features here the picture size is a 5 megapixel for a 4 to 3 aspect ratio and the video quality that can be done at best is 720p videos with both the front and the rear cameras. In our next video, we'll anyway do a full review of what the Android Go means and what are the applications that you get to use here and uh, what does Android Go offer to the users uh, who want a basic phone but then they don't want to have a different uh, interface or a different experience altogether. So this was a quick unboxing and the hands-on with the Lava Z50 the smartphone price is 4400 and that comes with the Android Go OS. Before we wrap up, uh, I'll announce the giveaway of the smartphone. We are going to give away the Lava Z50 about uh, 3 weeks from now after the review is done, full review. And then we'll give this phone away. For that, you need to be active on our channels, the Twitter channel, Facebook, as well as on YouTube. Be a regular commenter and this would be a random giveaway. We won't be re re really checking out uh, how active you are, but then you'll have to be active and good with our all the channels to be a winner of this Lava Z50 smartphone. So I hope you like this video, subscribe and share this video and stay tuned for the next one.